Hi everybody, this is Everyday Commentary, and this is a video overview of this product. This is the Tom Bin NYX Minimalist Wallet. There are four versions of the wallet. I have uh, had the chance to use all four. Um, I was very lucky to be one of the early product testers on this wallet. And I am going to give you the specs, and then I'm going to go through what I like and don't like, and I will tell you very quickly that the don't like is non-existent. This thing is awesome. So the wallet comes in four versions, and I'll go through those versions in a second. They range from $24 to $32, depending on the design and the materials. And there are four versions. So there is one version that has just pockets. There is one version that has pocket and window. And then there's one version that has pocket, window, and exterior window. And then there is another version that has the pocket, the window, and then a little tab so that you can hook it on to your Tom Bin gear through one of the other Tom Bin lock-ons. I'm gonna go through and talk about these two, which are the ones that I think most people will be interested in. Um, first of all, it's important to note that they come in a couple different colors. You can get them in a, a wide range of colors uh, with two different fabrics. There's 210 Ballistic and then there's 400 Hal uh, Halcyon. All of which are, uh, so the ballistic, ha uh, the 210 has uh, black, blue, tan, a bunch of different colors. And then the Halcyon comes in oh, basically dark blue and black only. Uh, here is uh, the Coyote version, I believe, uh, of the wallet in the, the 210 ballistic. Um, the inside is 120 denier. Uh, fabric and the entire thing uh, and this this window here is uh, clear urethane and the entire design um, regardless of which model you choose weighs just over half an ounce so this is about as minimalist as you can get the other really interesting thing about Nick's uh, minimalist wallet is that the design is based on origami um, as you can see there's really only one two seams everything else is just a fold and so they've done that to sort of minimize, minimize the wear and tear, minimize the design and the build, uh, and really just keep the things as small and as simple as possible. And if you want, you can see this is a comparison between a regular, uh, this is my ID, and uh, the wallet is just slightly larger than the ID. Unfortunately, it's not really practical to do anything other than to, to double fold your cash and stick it in there, it's not a big deal. Um, I carry uh, cash in my wallet. I carry th uh, four IDs, and well, two I uh, three IDs, uh, my health insurance card, and then uh, one other card and three credit cards. So in total, there are eight cards in cash in here. Uh, I carried this design and this design uh, as long, and this design, I've had this one for over a year. I carried it every day. The elastic's still plenty stretchy. It looks great. Uh, if I didn't, I'm not sure if you could, if I didn't tell you, I'm not sure you could tell which one was which. This one is brand new. This one is over a year old. Uh, the original design, the interior fabric um, had a metal lining and the metal lining sort of flaked out. Um, but I talked to them and, and they fixed that problem. The other thing is, I, I really liked the design, but I thought that it needed to have this window here so that you could have your ID. One really cool thing is, so when I, here's how you normally store the wallet. Let me, let me put some cards in here so you can see. It gets all, gets nice and floppy without the cards, but we'll put some cards in here so you can see how, how it can kind of behave. Uh, by the way, all these cards come with these wallets and just like another little cool touch from Tom Ben. Everything the other guy does is just cool, cool, cool. So, let's see. Put them in here. Okay, so when I go to the cashier, um, the wallet is like this. Because the band keeps it closed. And then I open it. And I have my hand behind here. And then I have my card. Show them my ID. Pull out the card. Give them the card. Close it up. The thing never leaves my hand. The other thing that you can do if you're in a place where you know you're gonna need your card a lot is you can open it and keep it in the opened position so that you can show your card. Uh, and then finally, in the model that has the exterior pocket, 
what you do is you can stick uh, your pass card in here and then stick the stuff that you want to be RFID blocked in here. And that way you can sort of walk up and tap the thing that you're going to use as your pass code and go. Uh, overall, I really, really like the wallet designs. Uh, the colors are going to be cool because, of course, they're Tom Bin colors. And the overall aesthetic is just super, super great. I could not ask for anything more from a wallet. I've had a bunch of wallets. I've been disappointed by a bunch of wallets. I've had a couple of wallets that were really quite good. The A-Slim and the Bellroy were really good. But in the end, they were really super expensive and they were not as nice as the Tom Ben wallet. So, if you are looking for a wallet and you want something that uh, can handle a couple of cards but doesn't turn into a hamburger and you would like it to look nice, I think this is the one you want. You can carry it in your front pocket, you can carry it in your back pocket, you can even carry it in your shirt pocket, which I've done a couple times, and it just it just carries great. So um, this is the Tom Bin NYX Minimalist Wallet, uh, and it's brand spanking new. Uh, I was just lucky enough to have mine for over a year, and I have been delighted. Uh, for me, uh, this is like the, uh, the, the blade key. This is basically one part of my everyday carry that is salt. So look for a review coming soon.